Do you want to learn how to catch peacock bass when they really don't want to eat? I just got back from a really fun trip in Florida and we were fishing through some canal systems for largemouth bass. We were casting things like this uh, Savage Gear armored tube worm on a wacky rig, very effective for the largemouth, caught plenty of them. Uh, we were also throwing some spinner baits, again, plenty effective. But when we spotted some peacock bass, they just wouldn't eat. Now, Captain Greg explained to us that they really like it hot and it was rather cool out, and they just don't get aggressive when it's cool. They really like superheated days. But he had a trick up his sleeve. Quite basically what we're doing is we're using a medium type of rod with a braid line anywhere in that 10 to 14 pound class because you never know there could be snook or tarpon in here. Um, we're going to do a popping pour with about a 20 pound liter because I do not know if we catch a snook or not. If we do, we got to have at least 20 pound liter. Uh, but primarily what we're looking for is peacock bass. And today we're going to use the popping forks so that we know where they're at and we can locate them. When we throw these popping forks along the shorelines, we're going to slowly let the first work its way down, all the way down the shoreline. And when the peacock bass does grab it, you're going to wait till that cork goes down for about eight seconds. And you're going to reel them on tight because you have a circle hook. So basically, there's our shiner, there's our popping cork. Fish. Wow. All right, just like you said, he cook it down and dang. Nice little female. See female. now, this is a female peacock bass because there's no there's no hump oh, on its sure. head. So his his her partner is in there. So we're gonna catch him next. Yeah, very nice peacock. Yeah, pretty color. Look at that color. It's a baby male. Oh, it's a young male. See, see, see the hump on him? Wow, cool fish. Nice fish. Oh, yeah, pretty. It is pretty. Beautiful. No, we didn't catch any giant lunkers. But hey, to catch an exotic like a peacock bass right here in the good old US of A, that's pretty cool. 